back again, end of turn two. All my reserves have turned up apart from one unit, one squad. Stug, Panther. Not been able to rally the uh, MG42. Terrible. My team's moved up behind the uh, building in the yard. Pack 36 covering the crossroads. 222's moved on forward. The squad's moved up, took some fire from Bob Sherman, causing a pin. He has his Vickers machine gun team in his building. Not good news for me. And the Mark's team here. Squad there and then round here. Bob bombardment that moved over, causing lots of pins, he's rallied his uh, para team. Brought this squad on. Observer's hiding behind the chicken shed with two pins on him. <laughs> <laughs> his HQ's hiding behind this house here. And the six pounders still covering the long road down to the crossroads. Um, it still has a Sherman Gat team and 10 tank destroyers to bring on. And I have a squad left to bring on. Rio! Hmm. I'm hoping to come round this flank with both my um, tanks and swing round to the objective. Because at the minute it's packed everything down this side of the board. Mm. Um, it's what to do, what to do next in turn three. I think I might just push forward, take some fire away from the um, Stug and Panther. See if I can cause a bit of trouble down this, this side, this side of the table. It's totally free. Got no units here at all. Those pins aren't on any units. That's what there's uh, four pins he's removed from the uh, para squad because the uh, bombardment token was moved because that was his own guys were bombing his own troops. Back in turn three. <laughs> 